Hey guys, welcome to the channel. In this video, I will show you how to connect and use your PlayStation 3 controller on Windows 10. This will also work on Windows 11. In order to use your PS3 controller on Windows, you will need this app called DS Hid Mini. We will leave a link to this application on in the video description. After you have this folder, firstly, go to x64. After that, to this other folder right in here and in here you need to install the information file right click it and press install this will prompt you to install this device software this is safe to install press on install and now install this IG filter uh, in file as well the same way all right, now it's done. Now go back into the root folder and open up this application. After installing these files, reboot your computer. All right, guys, after rebooting our computer, now by entering this application, as you can see, we have our PlayStation 3 controller successfully connected to our PC and is now recognized. Now in here, into the settings, you want to do something as well. So under the HID device mode, you need to set this to DS4 Windows. And this DS4 Windows app, which is an amazing application that I've been using for years now, you absolutely need to download as well. We will leave the uh, link in the description for this application. All right, and after choosing this mode, press on Apply Changes. Okay, and after downloading the DS4 Windows application, this is going to be your interface. Now you need to go to your settings right over here on this tab. Also, upon the first setup of this application you will need to install the drivers so i already have them installed but i will show you anyway so firstly you will need to perform this step one install this driver after that and also install this hit hide driver just in case then click on finished okay after doing that click on device options and click on ds3 controller support this will make sure that our PlayStation 3 controller is recognized by this program. Now close out and now basically press on start in here in the controllers tab. All right, and now you just basically need to unplug and plug back again your controller into Windows, into your PC. And as you can see, it's now successfully recognized. As you can see, DualShock 3, DS4 emulation. Then you can just choose your profile. As you can see, I have one for Genshin right here. I have played Genshin Impact by using my PlayStation 3 controller, which was very fun actually. And if you're curious, uh, you can also go into the added tab and go to controller readings. And now as you can see, everything is working. You're also shown the input delay as well in here. And if I, for example, move my analog sticks, as you can see, they are working, everything works. And also if I close out of here, go to settings again and click on gamepad test. And if I press any of my buttons or if I move my analog sticks, as you can see, my controller is successfully connected, recognized, and it works. And now after that, you can just log in into any game that you want and easily play it. Also, you can test vibration. You can actually listen to it. Everything works, guys. Okay, and lastly, guys, to demonstrate to you that everything works, I'm going to play this game for a bit, which is uh, Power Slave, an amazing game from the past, a blast from the past. I'm just going to load it. All of the things I'm performing now are done on my PlayStation 3 controller. All right, as you can see, everything works perfectly. I am playing the game. Buttons work. You can see it's functioning properly the way it's supposed to. And now you can play your favorite games by using your DualShock 3. So, thanks for watching this tutorial. Very easy to set it up. Hopefully, you have fun with your games using this controller. It's a great controller, although it's quite old now but it still works perfectly fine, even on Windows in 2024. If this helped, leave a comment if you've successfully managed to connect it and get it working in your system by using our tutorial.
like this video, subscribe to our channel and click on that notification bell to not miss new videos, and thanks for watching.